In high school, I didn't even know what chemical engineering was. Basically, when I looked online, a lot of people said magic. I don't think a lot of people think of an engineer and see, oh, track athlete. There's no one person who's an engineer. We're so different. There's so many people who come through the engineering department and really just bring their own uniqueness to it. So I'm originally from Scranton, Arkansas, a um, very small town. My graduating class was actually 30. Grew up on a farm, and so I was always around machinery and equipment. And then also the science side. My mom was a biology teacher. So I was drawn to the medical field right away. As a senior, I had no idea, honestly, what I wanted to do. The beginning of high school on, I was like, I'm gonna do sports science, I'm gonna do kinesiology, like I'm an athlete, that's what I do. But then I took the anatomy class and I came and saw the lab work and I was like, what do I have to do to be able to do this in a lab? Chemical engineering for me, I like the math and science, so it fit. I would never imagine I'd be basically changing the DNA of these cells to make them do things that I want. And so it's kind of this crazy idea. It's still, sometimes it's over my head still, but after you leave some of these classes, you look at the world and you're like, whoa, this is happening everywhere. The stuff I'm learning is happening everywhere and I would have never realized it until just now. <laughs> when I was looking at schools, I got in here and I decided to come out and visit and just see what the school had to offer. And from the moment I stepped on campus, um, it felt like home. We have a huge range of engineers in terms of their interests and where they come from and what they like to do and how they go about their lives here. Students are energetic. We can see progress with students when we work with them uh, from month to month in a course. I think that's one trait that all of us engineers know and we have is that we have a goal and we're going to work till we get it. Someone willing to put in the time worth the final product really strong math and science skills, and then also just be creative. You know, problem solving, what can you use to do that? Well, if you're not creative, then you're not going to be very good at it. Coming from Texas, I had tons of engineering options back home, but I think what's really unique is the fact that between the research, between just classes alone, I have so many hands-on opportunities, so many projects that I get to do, that I already feel like I'm an engineer in a sense. Of all the things that you can do at CSU as an engineer, I mean, in any major in general, is just get into research because it lets you take those skills that you're learning in the classroom and bring them to like real world application. And there's always that reward that you're finding something that maybe no one else has ever seen before. If you love where you're at, it's gonna make the school thing so much easier. And so visiting campus is the only true way for you to know, you know, is this the right school for me? I don't think people realize how awesome it is. <laughs> you know, it just, you can look at as many pictures as you want, but it's not gonna do it justice until you come see it. The sounds, the smells, you know, the attitude of people. It's great. <laughs>